What's up guys, I'm Crazy Act and welcome back to L Sword. So there's good news and there's bad news. The good news is that I did get a costume and now I look fabulous. And I have a tail, thanks to Menthu, so I, that's also pretty fabulous. And my sword is pretty awesome, so that is also fabulous. I also did get a new weapon, so I now have a plus six testament, or no, no, testament's one I had before. Plus six Bar Baradon Flail, so that's gonna be awesome for the upcoming dungeons. Oh, right, party, I'm in intellectual. Intellectualism is strong with this one, so. Um, the bad news is that the Burning Hope Bridge is now on fire. The, sorry, the Hope Bridge is now on fire, so it's our job to go and put it out. So, let's go ahead and do that. I must say, though, once we get Iron Dungeon here, I must say, though, the previous dungeon was kind of a bit of a jerk. Remember how I did very hard, and then I'm like, well, I have to do very hard again? I have to do it three more times. Three. Actually, legitimately, three more times I had to go and do it. Or we had to go and do it. It's just like that that quest is a giant pain in in everything. Menthu, help me kill cannons and stuff, please. Menthu, come help me. This is a, this is actually a very short dungeon though. Like it's that that's all it is, so it's actually a very, very short dungeon. So this shouldn't take too long for us to get through, I would think. But hey! I've been wrong before! So I mean why not? And, oh, and Menthu is doing his new attack, which is, uh, he sits there and charges, which is not that cool until you realize that he, I think the more he gets hit during that, the faster he charges his attack, and then he unleashes the pain of his attack among the poor masses below. Also, I have Critical Sword equipped instead of Windblade, which was a dumb idea. I should have Windblade instead, but, oops, I just left that on after trying it out. That's okay. Tis whatever, I shall change it afterward. Either way, Critical Sword allows me to get better critical rates and do more critical damage, so... Boop! And it doesn't take very much mana at all, so... Oh! Uh, move, Matthew! Matthew! Oh, that didn't hit him. I wonder if it went the other way on his screen. Uh, game? Alright, this one always takes a while for some reason. I'm not sure why. Come on! There we go. It always takes a while for some reason, so never do, like, Awakening right before that. Okay. Been a while since I've been- Ah! Crap! Been a while since I've been here, so I don't remember the layout of these. There's a specific layout that if you follow, you'll never fall down. But, uh, clearly I don't know it yet! Thank you, Mantheo! Do-do-do-do-do. Oh, yeah, okay. Oh, they yeah, killed them both. Nice! Nice! Go, Mantheo, go! Go! I guess he has to finish charging. Takes him a while to charge, I guess. I don't actually know the mechanics of the move he just showed me. It's actually pretty cool. Boop, 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 boop. Onto the next floor. Just two more to go and then to the boss. Very, very short dungeon. I actually remember the last dungeon that was this short. It would have been like the Tree of L, actually. I'm pretty sure most of the ones since then have been like seven plus. Anyhow, moving right along. We still got, I, I actually really like this transition in Builder because now we've gone from kind of the, like with the palace entrance, um, initially, we kind of went from the little more, like, hopeful, paramount, uh, we can win, let's go fight the bad guys kind of style to very much more, uh, ah, okay, a very much more, um, dark and almost depressing style, because you have everything on, burning on fire, um, you can actually hear the fires in the background, and it's, it's actually quite, uh, quite depressing in the end. Boop, boop, boop! Got it. And I like that change. It actually, like, it's almost like a character development, like in a movie or TV show. It's very much like character development, except it's for the level. It's for the player. It's it's actually quite a neat little transition that I quite like. Oh, more of these jerk bags. Well, that went, that escalated quickly. It's like, yeah, I really like the change, except for these jerk bags. Uh, that, that was normal. I intended for that to happen. Boop, boop. And do, 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 do. But yeah, like, the, the monsters don't change much, because you still have the stupid guys with the shields, and you have the glitter alchemists and necromancers, and... Oh, there's another one. You have all those guys, but... Uh, the actual, like, the feel of the atmosphere actually changes. Okay, come here. Yeah, I'll lure him down here. Yay, that worked out nicely. I lure him down, and Mentu goes and gets the kill. Wait, that doesn't sound like a very fair trade to me. Dang it, Mentu!
Remember guys, falling doesn't actually kill you. It can't actually kill you, but it does take a crap chunk of your health out, so. Boop. Okay, I'm gonna get my critical sword. Ah, you. Ah. Go, Menthu, go. Go, before he moves. Dang it. Eh, it's not gonna go well. Did he hit him? I don't know if he hit him. I don't know. That was off screen for me, so. I'm just gonna have to hope he did. Critical sword. See, I actually, like, uh, normally I play a deadly chaser, as you guys have seen before, like with my Eldrion battle. But, um, uh, he has a, a move called Sharpshooter Syndrome, which increases, um, which increases critical rate. But it increases, ah, okay, that's fire, that's fire, that pot burns, thank you. Um, actually increases my critical rate, oh, come on. It actually increases my critical rate much higher than uh, this one does, at least so far. It's only about 4% higher as opposed to, like, 20%. Come on, man! What are you doing over there? Yeah, that's a good idea. Let's just lure him over here. Yeah, okay. There we go. He still has 10 health bars, though. Like, jeez. Okay, good. This this part is marginally less annoying. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, you got him. Good job. Way to go, Menthu! Way to go! He did it! Yay! Uh-oh. No, more fire. Fire is bad. Fire is bad. I'm gonna die here. I'm totally going to die. Yep, Mentu just died, and I'm next. Boom. Uh-oh. Okay, good. The fire just went out right as I went into it. Okay, I just have to keep him right here so Mentu's attack can land. Just keep him right here. Nope. No, no, no. Push him back this way. Go, 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 Mentu. Go, 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 go. You get him? Ah. This little def this little, little fire defense thing of his is kind of irritating. Dang it, dang it, dang it! Dang it, I thought it was gone! I almost survived that! You gotta be kidding me! Such BS! Such BS! Complete and utter rage. We'll go to the Gates of Darkness and then we'll come back and do very hard. Thank you, our people are evacuating safely across the Hope Bridge. Good, another problem is now dealt with. Okay, now we can get back to work. Let me brief you on our operation. Our goal is to drive the demons away from Velder, and we have two tasks we must complete to achieve that goal. Right now, the members of the Velder garrison are scattered. Some are trying to enter and escape the palace, while others are cornered fighting the enemy in small groups. Our first task is to gather and reorganize the Velder garrison, and that is our priority. The second task is... Well, I'll tell you when you accomplish the first task. Wow, thanks! Now you sound like our reliable captain again. Ha! We must first minimize casualties to gather more Velder garrison soldiers. Please neutralize the siege towers and secure a road of retreat. Alrighty. I don't know what any of that means. But I know that we have to go do Burning Hope Bridge on very hard. I'll do it up. Let's do it up. I also fire enchanted my weapon and put Windblade back in the slot while things were going on. Alrighty. Let's put down this crazy puppet once and for all. Was Menthu's like pose? Was that just like poking me in the eyes or something? That's kind of what it looked like. Okay, I'll leave that to you. You have fun with that. Do, 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 do. I'll just go on my merry way and do my merry things while you stab all your people with your fists. I just quite that like that move of his, but it's it's kind of like, well, there's no point in me hitting anything in front of him if he's doing it, because, well, he's going to take care of it. Like, yeah, like that. He's just going to... Here he goes. <laughs> Boop. Got him. See? What was the point of me helping there? It's actually a pretty cool move. It's just that when you have a whole bunch of people hitting stuff, well, uh-oh. My inventory is full. That's not good. I'm gonna lose good loot. I'm gonna lose good loot from this. It's not good. Oh well. It's not like it's worth that much. Just a bit. Ah, he is a big head. <laughs> That's still funny to me. Like, unless it's happening to me, of course, because then I'm like, oh, now I can't jump or anything. See? You can't jump with that. But, uh, it's funny when it happens to someone else because you're like, haha, they have a big head. These are things that are funny. It amuses me, like the tail does. I'm, I don't know, I'm weird. I guess I'm just easily amused by small things or something, but... You know, whatever. Anyways, you may have noticed the uh, quest I'm doing is not the very hard quest. It's actually the harder, higher quest. Which, because there were two of them. There, we went and did it on hard, then it's like, oh, we have to do it again, so... So we just realized we might as well just do it on very hard, because at this point I haven't showcased much of the quests anyway. So I might as well just go ahead and show the important stuff, which is me, you know, kicking butt as a rune slayer, so... Now we have to wait for this level to expire again. Tick tock. Tick tock. Do do do. I don't know why this one takes so long. Reminds me of a bit of uh, Birth's boss fight. Alrighty. Down. Up. Ba do. 
See, it only took me like one or two tries to remember what the order was to these, so. Ah, come on, you little jerkbag cannons. And got him. Phoenix Talon's actually incredibly useful. Is he gonna do his charge thing? No, he's not. Okay. I thought he might do his charge thing. Oh, now he is. Okay, fine. You do your charge thing then. I'll let you do it. I'm gonna be a good teammate, a good crazy act, and let you do that. Ugh. Yeah, I stuck myself with a wyvern in the process, though. You know, I'm just gonna put an end to this. This sad existence. Or not! Apparently, it still wasn't enough. Okay, Phoenix Talon. There we go. I thought that might do it. Beep, beep, beep. On to the next floor. Why do I have absolutely no health at all? I didn't even fall off the thing. Why am I like half dead? More than half dead. I have like 40% health. That ain't good. It just ain't good. Yeah, you can have him. Enjoy. <laughs> I'm such a troll noob. Ow. Yeah, see, he can actually, he completely super armors during that, so he can take like a giant brunt of hits. Hey, how did you hit me after you were dead? Moreover, while I was attacking after you were dead. That's not very fair. Boop. Uh-oh, this is a bad idea. Bad idea. They hit me. I don't like being on fire. Hey, what cursed me? Oh, someone threw a potion and it cursed me. Okay, fine, whatever. Boop. Okay, I'm gonna need to heal. There we go. It's a, not much health, but it'll do. I should be using the potions that I'm getting from that quest. No, give me the blueberry. Thank you. Boop. And then just walk off and yep. No! Come on! That was. Oh jeez, oh jeez. That took a lot of health out of me real fast. Stupid cannon. It's all the cannon's fault. It's legitimately the all the cannon's fault. It launched me into the freaking river of lava and then then everything just went downhill from there. So I blame it for everything. Uh oh. Okay, good. I managed to hit all of them actually, I think. Ba doop ba doop ba doop. Oh, jeez, I'm dying. I am dying. Things that are not good. Me dying. At the very, the very top of the list. Hopefully I can actually... Okay, I can use the heal again. Hey, Menthu's health went down, too. Boop, boop. Uh-oh. Don't fall in. Don't fall in. Stabby! I'm not dying. I'm not dying. I'm not dying. I'm not dying. What are you talking about? I'm not dying. Please don't tell me this is... Oh. No, this isn't the boss, but it's worse. Ugh. Yeah, it's worse. I, I, I kid you not. At least for people with low health. In, in general, it's fine. But it's just that when you have low health and you get to this guy, his name is Invincible Varden. He's not exactly invincible, but he's still a jerk. Ow. Okay, just, just die. Stupid shield jerk face. Menthu, do you not have any healing items? Is that what's going on here? I don't think Menthu has any healing items. He'll be okay, though. He always pulls through. Stabby. Oh, no. No! Ow. I gotta actually dodge some stuff if I'm gonna survive this. Oh, he got an HP plus 50. All I got was a lousy bury your enemies in the ground token. I went to Burning Hope Bridge and all I got was this lousy t-shirt. Why is he fighting Invincible Varden by his own? Is he doing his charge up attack? Is that is that what he's doing? I can see him doing that. You dead, bro! Oh yeah, I got you. More glitter's teeth. So I can get more potions that I won't use. Menthu, why are you doing this by yourself? I just, I, I have to ask so many questions. No, oh, ow. He's charging up, letting me distract him, of course. Ow, no! No, I hate that move! I hate that move so much. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh, of course, yeah. That's good. No, I I have health. I totally have health. What are you talking about? <laughs> Stabby. Okay, good. He's down. Hit him. Okay. This this dungeon has been a bit of a trial. Okay, I got some health from him. Good. But I can't go away, f go frittering it away now. Uh oh. Yeah. Okay, I hate those things. Boop. And get rid of this stupid cannon before it blasts me off the edge. I think the other cannon just got Menthu, so it is a very real danger. The struggle is real. Uh, okay, 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 now die! Die! Burn! Burn and die. Die and burn. Thank you. Okay. Ow! Now it's boss time. I have about a third of my health, according to my mana bar. 
Ah, less than a third now, because of the stupid arrows. This is not gonna be fun. It is not gonna be fun. Okay, crazy puppet. It's playtime, but it's not gonna be fun. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, to avoid the flame and attack, uh huh. So maybe if I just go up here and stab him with Windblade and punch. That might have been a bad idea because it lost me quite a bit of health, I think. Ah, really? Again? Yeah. Uh, okay, ow, ow. Okay, that kind of hurt. Okay, now the easy ish part. All I have to do is find the guy and destroy him. Punch! Yeah, the punch is actually really useful for that. Menthus is better, his, uh,. His cannon bolt, but I don't know. No, no. Nope. But the punch is actually still pretty good for that. Uh oh! Don't walk into the fire. Don't walk into the fire yourself. It's a trap. Avoid the flame and attack. Okay. Really? 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 Okay. What are you doing, buddy? Just like acrobatic show here. I guess he kind of does look like a clown. He could be in a circus. He could only totally be in a circus. You like the the. They called him the ringmaster? He could totally be the ringmaster for a circus. Oh man, this guy's really annoying to fight with only two people. I'll tell you that much right now. Stabby. Oh, again. Actually, no, this is the good part. This is the good part. I'm okay with this part. Where is he? Oh, he's over there. Got him? Nope. Just got myself burned, I think. Uh-oh, I'm so almost dead, it's not even funny. No, 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 no! Okay. Menthu, no! Menthu. I'm gonna try and not do what I did last time and accidentally run into a fire. You get him? No, 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 Yeah, I don't wanna die, I don't wanna die, I don't wanna die, I don't wanna die! Oh, made it. Health thing, health thingy. Got it, okay. Okay, more gates of darkness, but I'm not gonna show them, so I'm just gonna head and head on and say thank you guys so much for watching. There's more videos in the playlist in the description down below if you wanna check them out. Until the next one, guys, I'll see you later. Let's find the next cube, Gomez. Or should I call you Fizzmez? Yeah, that, that made sense. Don't question it, it made perfect sense. Hello there, are you my wife? Kissy, kissy, I love my wife. But I'm going to go on an adventure without you, Mrs. Wife. <laughs>